strap broke. We got a backup. Chester, no. No. Okay, that one's fine. Ready? Go. Oh. Hot. <laughs> I don't know why we thought that was a good idea, but we made it. We decided to change up our location today and we hiked into the forest and found what I think is a nice clearing to test out our brand new tent. Oh, first things first though, we gotta, gotta shovel some of the snow out. This new tent's footprint is 115 square foot. So we gotta make sure we just get some of this fluff out of the way. There's six sides to this thing. Uh, oh gosh. Oh, I can do it. Do it. Do it. Oh man. That's hard. You can do it. Yeah, you got it. Nice. Yeah, we got all the sides. Yeah, is it gonna fit? I think so. I'm gonna have to move it my way here. Okay. Come on, Becky. Oh, sorry. Nice. Wow. This place is huge. Okay. So, as you can see, this tent is quite an upgrade in size from our uh, our other one. Room for activities. <laughs> Chester. Chester. Oh my gosh. This is a big ice fishing hut, and the original plan for today's video was take this out in the ice. Uh, the only problem is we just don't have enough ice yet on the big lakes. Um, I went out yesterday to check. We got about five inches. Um, it's plenty to walk on and even ice fish on. It's just not enough ice for us to feel safe to, safe enough anyways to spend the night. A difficult thing is trying to figure out how to set everything up. Like this is quite a bit different than our usual setup. Our cots are uh, much further apart than usual. <laughs> I didn't like that. No, but Chester has his own bed. And another cool thing is that it has a built-in stove jack for uh, for the wood stove. That's so bushcraft. You bushcrafted your own broom? Yes, it is. You're so talented. Thank you. light a fire. Let's get it warm in there. Yes. Oh, hello. Chester is excited for hello that. Buddy. Let's go get warm. For once, we actually brought our own wood. <laughs> this is more convenient. That's how things worked out today. Come on. There we go. Looks so pretty. Do your thing. Oh, 
Okay, okay. I know, I know. Tonight, we brought with us this Hunkin Instant Pot. <laughs> Uh, we're going to be making my mom's turkey chili recipe. To start, we're just going to peel some carrots. <laughs> Look how pretty this one is. Whoa! And celery. And onion. And garlic. And green pepper. Gentle. We got power. <laughs> okay, so first thing we have to do a little saute. Saute. It's on saute mode. Nice. I'm going to add a little oil. Mix it all in. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. oh. You're fireworks? What are you doing? Airing out my eyes. Pre-cook some turkey, so we'll throw that in. We got two cups of chicken broth. Can of tomatoes. Diced tomatoes. Sorry, diced. One and a half cups of pure pumpkin. Maybe beans. I want to mix it just so I can eyeball it a little bit. It's supposed to be all of them, unless you don't want to put all of them. No problem. Just like to eyeball it. <laughs> and hit the chili button on this. Where's the chili button? Is there a chili button? You said there was. Uh, chili. 30 minutes. Okay. We'll have a finished product. That's a good beep. Not a bomb about to explode. While we're waiting for our chili to finish, we got about 25 minutes left. Give you a quick temperature update. It is a beautiful 23 degrees in here. Minus five outside for my American friends. Nope, that's the wrong button. It is a 74 in here and 22 outside. Trying to get down to. Minus 14. Minus 14 tonight. Four centimeters of snow and then five more in the morning. <laughs> Maybe put, put a hat back on. Oh, really? <laughs> hair is wild. Mm -hmm. You need a haircut. Because when you don't wear a hat, it's wild. The cook is done and we let it naturally release its pressure for 10 minutes now. I think we'll release the rest of it and be ready to eat. The scariest thing about these pots. Nice. Oh, it looks decent. Yeah, let me give it a little. Oh, that was hot. A little mix through. Yeah. What? I just. nothing. Hope we did your recipe uh, justice, Mom. It's good. Very good. We're missing bread. Bread would have been... Cheddar cheese. Garlic bread. Cheddar cheese. Garlic oh, bread. Put a little top. Oh, cheddar cheese. Yeah, that's what I keep saying. <laughs> oh. But the chili is really good. Very good. 8 out of 10. Mm-hmm. 9 out of 10 with garlic bread, though. And cheddar cheese. Oh. Yeah. 
chili coma? Mm hmm. Hey, what was your rating? My rating was 8.7. Wow. Also agreed that the cheddar cheese. Would have bumped it to a 9? Would have bumped it to a 9. So, it is currently 7.30 here, but for us it feels more like 12.30. <laughs> we just got back a couple days ago from, what was it, 10 day trip? Mm -hmm. From Europe, we, we spent a couple days in uh, London, and then we headed out to the Canary Islands, to the island of Tenerife. Chester, what the heck are you doing? You passing at my house. Chester, those aren't your toys. So our clocks are still a little bit messed up. So I'll just say that we're pretty tired right now. I think <laughs> all that to say. All that to say, we're both tired. Look at these bags, man. Um, I'm gonna let Chester out for a pee real, real quick, maybe a poop. How do you feel about that, Chester? You want him back in already? I think he's tired too, Joel. Yeah. That's a good boy. Hi, Betty. Hi. Don't get your blankie. Come here. He's like, I don't know where to go. <laughs> We're separated, eh? As of now, it seems that Chester has chosen Joel's cot. I win. See where he ends up in the morning. I don't think he'll be there. Or if he's there now, he'll be here, and then he'll be... All around? Yeah. He's so far away from me. <laughs> I can't even reach your hand. I know. <laughs> it's okay, I have Chester. We have a very comfortable 20 degrees in here. <whistles> A.K.A. 69 degrees. <laughs> I think that's it for today. We will catch up with you guys in the morning. Good night. Good night. <laughs>morning something uh oddly peaceful about waking up and sleeping in the middle of the forest especially that it's covered with snow
with the stack separating or something like that. We like to play hide and seek with Chester.